Hey everybody, this is Scott Grammer and I am the old audio guy and what we have here is a cassette deck with a stuck meter. So you can see this meter is stuck at around minus five. We can tap it and it moves a little bit, but it's it's pretty well and thoroughly stuck. So what we're going to do to unstick this, we're going to try anyway, it's not always successful. We're going to cut this tape that holds the front on, the front, on, front uh, plastic of, of most VU meters is just held on with tape. And so we're going to see if we can get that tape out of the way. Hopefully without cutting my hand off. There we go. I think we've got it started. Well, the tape is uh, not in good shape and so it tears easily. So we'll keep pulling it around like this. And there we are. Now I should be able to get the front off it. I might have to give it a little assistance here. There we are. And it kind of hinges on another piece of tape. So there is an adjustment screw here. This type of movement is called a de Arsenval movement. It has a voice coil like a speaker around a circular magnet and when you run current through the voice coil it moves like a motor. So what's happened is somehow or another this has gotten too tight and it's gripping the needle bearings of the needle. Uh, by the way the needle bearings and needle are not related. The needle bearings are called that independent of the fact that they hold a needle in place. In any case uh, the needle bearings are too tight and it won't let it move. Now we can't just adjust this screw because there's paint on it. So what we're going to do so we're going to use a little acetone on a swab and now you can see the green on the swab. This is where I did the other meter a moment ago. And we're just going to see if we can get that paint off of there and hopefully get it at least softened up in the grooves of the screw there, the threads. So there's that. And now we're going to see if we can back this screw off. Like I say, sometimes this works and sometimes it doesn't. And looks like it did this time. Let's back it up a little further. There we go. And that's what I want to see. And then we'll simply fold the lid back over. And we'll secure it with another little, another little dab of tape on the bottom. And now we have a fixed meter. There you go. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.